Hello friends, Mav again with another episode for my stupid lucky playthrough of Oxen Not Included. How are you doing today? We got ourselves a nice cup of coffee. We're going to take some uh, very concerted effort to solve some of the problems that we've introduced to ourselves. Number one, we're going to work on oxygen generation to start with. Heat's a little bit of an issue, but then we're going to worry about, we need some uh, refined metal and then we're going to go for our electrical grid. So here we go. Oh, and it's dupe time. Here we go. What do we got? We got us a digger. Look at that. Immune to food poisoning. But he's, he really doesn't dress very well. Funny. He's <laughs> immune to food poisoning, but decreased germ resistance. Um... I think actually we're gonna go for the fertilizer this time. We're already at 15 dupes. We already have an oxygen problem and we've got a power problem to boot. So we're kicking in this coal generator to try to help us out a little bit um, because we are running behind the curve a little bit and we need to fix some things. So we're putting power back into here and let's give this one some attention. So we're going to expand the floor a little bit right there. We're going to build another electrolyzer. We need some more piping. And then we need some more power for this guy. And we're going to come we're going to come off right here, I think. And we'll dig that out, we'll dig that out. We are going to need a ladder to finish this, though. And we're going to come right here. And we're going to close this in. Um, we're going to have, we're going to have this little tiny closed in box that makes oxygen and hydrogen. And we are stuck because we're out of power on that side because we're not getting hydrogen through here. So how do we fix that momentarily? How do we fix that? Come on, this guy, we want this guy. Let's just do that just momentarily because we need to get some hydrogen pumped through there. All right, let's stop. All right. Let's see how that works out for us. See if that uh, increases anything for us in the terms of oxygen. Looks like we're hopefully not going to be sucking in any more carbon dioxide. And, oh, a little bit. Might have a little bit. But if, if this overpressurizes, hopefully it'll push this carbon dioxide down and out a little bit. All right. So hopefully that'll fix some of our power problems too because now we've got full power generation right here yeah hopefully that picks us up but now we've got too much power being consumed on this line yeah we need to fix our power we need to fix our power really bad let's turn this guy off we don't need any more power to him all right now that we've addressed that issue let's get this stuff finished. I want to get this cleaned out so we can get this start pumping again because we rerun the piping to here so we don't have to uh, we don't have to worry about it cooking our own base anymore which was kind of terrible idea but now we've got we've got copper being made Unfortunately, this is going to generate a lot of heat right here, and we don't want heat in our base, so we're going to shave a little bit of this off here, because what that'll do, hopefully, is that'll radiate some cold in here, the heat will come this way, hopefully that'll balance some of the heat issues. We're also going to be dumping hot water into here, which is going to start melting this ice. Well, not all of this is ice. Some of this is rock. 
and hot water doesn't melt rock last I checked but yeah so we got a little bit of cold radiating in here so hopefully that'll cut down on some of these heat issues we're gonna self-impose here all right Ooh, look at that that's toasty hot how's that looking yep we got oxygen we got hydrogen being made oxygen's going out in the base hydrogen's coming down here making power yeah all right now do we have enough water looks like we have enough water for a while that being said i do want to finish moving this over because i want to make i want to open this up i want to i want to get this all symmetrical and i want to be able to go down because i can go down on this side but I, I really want it all to be symmetrical it's kind of important to me let's see here okay And let's see, we need to do some research. How's our research looking? We're doing pretty good on getting stuff knocked off the list, but we haven't gotten started with the next stage of, of researching things. So there's not a lot that we still need, but we might as well just get it done. So then we don't have to worry about it in the future. So food's also gone terrible on us. We're down to 6,000 calories. We're going to need to fix that right now. This is not a super fast solution here, but this is a solution. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to put spinely grub fruit plants up here. We, we dug a couple of them out right here. We're gonna get their seeds and we're gonna put them right here. And the reason I wanna do that is I wanna, I wanna diversify my food supply just a little bit. Uh-oh, uh-oh, somebody made a mess. Who made a mess? You peed in the water, my gosh. Uh, why do you people always Oh, because you're trapped in here. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Whoops. Sorry, guys. Mav did a mistake. Well, gosh. That was bad. Sorry. Sorry. Gotta mop all that dirty, grody water up, which is probably too late. We've infected. Yep. We've infected our clean water Ugh. because we pooped in the pond. Oh, that's too bad. That's really too bad. Oh, I feel bad now. I feel bad. Oh, okay. Well, let's move on with life. Nothing we can do about it today, but move on. Let's see. Still not quite up to par on our power generation, but we are getting close on hopefully refined copper so that we can get started on things. Let's see here. Copper ore. All right, here we go, copper. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, I'm gonna hack my way into this side over here. And while these guys are over there working, I'm going to I'm going to plan some stuff out power-wise. So we're going to need actually going to need um we're going to need another ladder. No. Well, we are. We we're, we're going to need ladder, but it's going to be later on. So we're going to go What I want to do is right here, right here. Oh, it's mad because we're out of uh, we're out of materials. And then what we're gonna do is oh, we're out of materials. So it's not gonna let us build any of it. So ladder, 
we are going to come down like this. I'm going to come all the way down to here. And we do need some floor tiles. Oop, save. We're going to go to this. What I'm doing is I'm going to run a really large power wire down the outside and then I'm going to have a smaller power line that feeds, individually feeds every level of the base. Oh, still short. I don't want to crack that open just yet. I want to let them, I want to let the dupes get some, get some work done here. But we're going to go like this. We're going to go all the way down to here. And while we're doing that, I do want to put in a block right there. Because I want to keep that chlorine separate. I don't really want chlorine in my base right now. So we'll do that. We'll do that. I need another ladder. All right. So that's not really helping our oxygen issues much because we still don't have a sealed base. But we'll get there. We'll get there. Uh-oh, unreachable food. Why do you have unreachable food? Because we're out of food. That makes sense. These guys are not growing because of pressure. We, we have a problem with air pressure. So... One way to fix our temporary food problems is to go digging. I know that sounds weird, but you go dig stuff up and you might find some food. Because see all these little cracked blocks right there? They could have something good in there. And it's due time. Hopefully, hopefully it's a care package and we can get some food. Uh, well, we can eat dirt. We just got to put water in it. Speaking of which, it's not a bad idea. It's not a bad idea for the moment. To kind of fix our kitchen. Because that is another goal I have, is to fix the kitchen. And you, why don't you guys pick that stuff up? Why won't you do that? It says unreachable. Oh, because you can't fit through that little hole there. All right, let's do that. <laughs> this Travaldo's the glow stick. That's so funny. All right, come on. Let's come pick this up. Don't get scalded. See, Harold, you're supposed to hurry. You guys are supposed to hurry at this. And... Let's see. Once you guys get all this stuff picked up and put away, we're going to block this off and we're going to keep all this heat that you're making. You're going to keep it in here and it's probably going to end up breaking this copper pump. Um, but I'm not too concerned about it at the moment because we're not using the crude oil yet to make anything. So I'm not I'm not too concerned at the moment. Oh, really, Mima. Come on. Let's just let yourself fall down. There you go. There you go. What do we got going on now? Have, did we pick up any food? It doesn't look like we picked up any food. Let's try again. There's a lot of them right here. Let's see. We got to save ourselves from ourselves. We got to get some food, you guys. And we need to crack that open, let, start letting this oxygen out because there's no air up here. Somebody's scalded, but he's fine. Seeds, oh, we found some muck roots, so somebody can eat today. Let's see here. Okay, good, we got that built. Let's crack that open. As we work our way down here, we're gonna crack into this. So. And this is all oxalite right here. So I want to change that to a really low priority level. Um, because what it'll do is it'll off-gas in here. 
who's who's causing me problems today? The cook is picking up bricks, which is good. Good. Night. And if you don't have anything to cook, you might as well go pick stuff up. Who's hurt though? Nobody. Nobody's hurt enough to go to the hospital. Nobody's hurt enough to go to the hospital. All right, you guys. We're just we're just done with you. We're not even going to worry about that anymore right now. Don't don't wall in people. That that would really annoy me if you just wall people in. And then let's let's kill all those orders because I, then I don't want to see all the blinky lights. There we go. Okay, so we got that walled in. Now what's going to happen is this is going to make a ton of heat. This is going to try to push some of the heat out but it's already overheating. So we're not gonna get that much more oil out of it right now, which is fine. I'm not too worried about it at the moment. Let's see, what else we got going on here? Let's dig out some of these tiles because they're cold and they're in the way of the melting. There we go. There we go. What's the temperature like in there? Pretty cold. How are we doing on food? We're up to 3,600 calories. Good deal. I want to clear that out because I just don't like it. All right, we're into here. We are going to crack that open right there. Now, this is going to start leaking some heat into our base. And I, it, I'm not really fond of that. So let's try to block it off a little bit. Let's do that. Let's do that. How much further does that go? All, all the way. There we go. So our goal is we're going to get these power transformers and then each transformer is going to run one level in our base and then we're going to come somewhere over here where it's already really hot and we're going to put in a uh, power generation plant which means we're going to have to move um, we're going to have to move a bunch of this stuff which will be fine it'll be no big deal unreachable food Bonnie cannot reach food probably because we don't have any sweetheart I don't, I don't want you getting all cranky at me. We just don't have any food at the moment. Let's see here. Um, what's that? Oh, that's a muckroot. Let's get that out. Let's get that out. Let's do this. And let's go over here. All right, and we're digging, uh, we're doing a lot of weird digs here just because I want to get to these little cracked pieces because they're buried objects and you never know what's in there and there might be food and we're, we're actually pretty hungry right now. I mean, we're at uh, 1600 calories. That's, that's enough for like one dupe for a day and a half and we got 15 dupes. So we got, we got food issues. But we're going to start getting some more food here momentarily. These guys are getting, they're about halfway done. We're, we're going to do okay. This is, this is not a big deal. We're up to 3,200. Looks like we found some more. Oh, no. It looks like we might have lost all of our, uh, all of our shine bugs. Oh, that's so sad. Oh well, wasn't a good idea anyway. It was just something to play with. Let's see. What else we got going on? I think we've made a really good start to uh, getting our electrical sorted out here. And uh, we're starting to get our, our oxygen generation fixed. 
Uh, we do hit max pressure every once in a while because we got a lot of carbon dioxide in here. So we gotta gotta keep on working to get these problems fixed that we've generated for ourselves. And with that, I hope you guys have a great day. See you next time.